Hey guys, so today I'm going to be trying out different coffee places in Lubbock. So if you know anything about me, I like coffee. Sometimes, I don't know, coffee is weird with my body, but that's not what this video is about. But yeah, today I'm gonna to be reviewing some of the most popular local coffee places in Lubbock and I'm gonna be taking y'all along. So I'm gonna be rating them out of three different categories. Uh, first one is coffee, second one is convenience, and the third one is cozy. So coffee, how does the coffee taste? Convenience, if it's convenient for students and cozy, what the place is like inside. So yeah, I'm gonna be taking you guys along with me and we're gonna check them out. As it was. All right. So I've got my first coffee of the day. We've got Monomyth, so starting off strong. So first taste test. That is pretty good. You can taste the coffee. I feel like in some coffee places, you can't really taste it. It's like watered down. But this one, I got the hot vanilla latte because it's kind of cold outside. So yeah, I would give it on a coffee scale, four out of five stars. All right, for the convenience score, I think Monomyth gets a strong five. They definitely got my coffee out in less than like two minutes. It was super quick, so that was kind of crazy. Um, and it is also right down Broadway. It is super easy to get to. I think it's only like two minutes away from campus. So definitely a cool, easy spot that you could go to. And for the cozy factor, I'm gonna give it a, I'm gonna give it a, a four. Um, I really enjoyed how there's a lot of tables set up so you can sit down and really work with like uh, your friends or if you've got any group projects, you guys can just meet up at Monmouth and get your group project done out of the way. All right, so the final score for Monomyth is 13 stars. All right, guys, so I just got back from Seven Brew. I got a iced, I got the Ice Brunette small, and yeah, I haven't tried it yet, so I'm about to try it right now. And I also got a decaf because if I keep doing this for every coffee video, I am going to die. So yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's really good. Dang. Oh, all right. This one, easy, easy five stars for me. This is really good. It's light, it's sweet. Uh, so this one has chocolate and caramel inside. And I, get, I got this iced because I got this one warm and I was like, I should get something refreshing. So I got this one iced, but wow, this one's really good. I really recommend getting the br the brunette. This one, top 10, one of my favorites. So yeah. All right, and now for the convenience score, I'm definitely gonna give this a five out of five stars as well, because it is right next to campus and the way they've got it set up, it's like a drive-through. So especially if you're just like driving to campus, you can just stop by here and it literally takes less than five minutes and boom, you've got coffee. So convenience, five out of five. Sadly, because of this, the cozy factor is a one out of five stars. It doesn't really have a place for you to like sit down. Um, there are a few benches outside, but if it's like a cold day or if you're trying to like work with a group project, you can't really do that. And there's also not that much parking. I had to park at CVS to walk over there, get a few shots, and then walk back to my car, get in the drive through and get the coffee itself. So sadly, I'm gonna be giving it a one out of five stars. So that puts Seven Brew at 11 stars. So that is still pretty good. All right guys, so I just got back from Hebrews and I got their signature coffee and I also got a chicken panini because I was kind of hungry and I heard their sandwich was really good. So yeah, first taste test of the coffee. Oh, that is good. It's kind of like a brown sugar. So if you really like brown sugar cinnamon, then this is like something for you. Um, but to rate the coffee, I'm gonna give it four out of five stars. I really liked it, but I think I'm gonna give the convenience score a three out of five stars. It's kind of far from campus. It's about like a six, seven minute drive. 
uh, but they're really quick and you can also order online. That's what I did. And I'm also gonna give it a five stars on the cozy scale because they had a ton of chairs and it's really nice because you're surrounded by nature. So this is definitely a cool place to go on a weekend or like a really nice sunny day. I would strongly recommend it because you can get a drink and then you can just walk around. So that's definitely five out of five on the cozy scale. I'm gonna give Hebrews 12 stars plus a sandwich because I thought it was good, so I strongly recommend it. All right, I didn't have time to do a review on my car, so I'm just gonna do a quick review right now. Um, coffee, it's really good. I got the Lubbock High, and that one I was like, I gotta get it because it has a Lubbock but they had other seasonal drinks and they had other like Texas Tech themed drinks. I think they had one about the um, Master Rider and the Red Raiders, so that was pretty cool. But yeah, this one's really good. I give it a four out of five. I think this one was better than Monomyth. And um, on the cozy factor, I give JMB five out of five stars. Dude, that place was so nice. They really decorated it. And as I was walking in, there was this girl outside planting plants like planting flowers so i thought that was pretty cool that they really like like to create that type of environment so that was nice and then for the convenience factor i'm gonna give it a four you know it's only about four minutes away from campus and it's not that far and it's a great place to go and do your homework or meet up with a group project and they also had very great service i got the coffee out super quickly so yeah that gives it uh 14 stars all right, so quick recap. This one was J&B's, this one was Hebrews, this one was Monmouth, and this one was Seven Brews. So I think out of all of them, my number one top favorite coffee would have been Seven Brew. It was like less than $5 and it tasted really good. I really liked it, one, that one. Um, but based off of the coziness factor, I think J&B definitely won from what I saw, there was like a ton of people studying and I really like the vibes going on. So yeah, coziness factor, JMB won. And for the convenience factor, I want to say that Seven Brew wins again because it was right next to campus and it was drive through So it's very easy, but some honorable mentions that I do want to mention is I really liked Hebrews uh, sandwiches. They were really good. I wasn't really expecting much, but dude, that hit so good. And another thing that I did like about Monomyth is that they did have places for you to like sit down and study. I like they had see these like chairs right um, in front of Broadway so you could see the road. So that was also a really nice chill spot where you could just do homework and just relax. That wraps up the video. I have drank way too much coffee today and I'm not going to drink coffee for like another month now because I, I just drank so much today. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you guys have any recommendations or any places that I should try, please let me know down in the comments below. So yeah, that's about it. We'll see y'all next week, and we hope you have a good weekend. Weekend, yes, weekend.